Well, Lorna Courtney has been making crowds roar on Broadway in And Juliet. The new musical blends glitter and girl power to ask what if Juliet had lived at the end of Shakespeare's classic. Featuring the biggest hits of the 20th century, it's also a big breakout for Lorna, who just earned her first Tony nomination. And she's here with you. me now. Congrats, Lorna. That's huge. Thank you so so much. So I was um, I was at my best friend's house when I when I watched the Tony Award nomination, and I was so shocked and overcome with emotion and joy. And we just started screaming and jumping up on the couch. She lives in the Upper West Side, and I'm a New Yorker. I'm from Queens. I love that. <laughs> I love that you're a New Yorker. I feel like part of like this this you, this is kind of a new take. Everyone knows this character, right? Everyone knows Julia, but this is a new take. You are like breathing new fire into this story. Um, I'm just like, what spin did you want to put on this version of Juliet that, that people, mm -hmm. people may not be expecting? This version of Juliet, she of course is like, she has two different worlds. She has the imaginative, bubbly, maybe Disney, but then she also has the bite and, and the grit and the, the experience that she gains. Um, she starts off as a 14-year-old girl and is in her 20s yeah. by the end of it. So she, her journey is becoming a woman and, and really just being able to, to, to stand up for herself and to find yeah. her voice and to find power within herself and make her own choices. Yeah, so. you, know, you mentioned you're a New Yorker. You, you grew up in Queens. Do you feel like there's a little bit of a New York edge to this Juliet? Oh, definitely. Right? You could take a girl out of Queens, but you can't take Queens out of her. That's right, that's <laughs> right. And what personal touch that you're adding to the performances every night is you wear a little something I of your do, own. I do, I do. So I have a, a couple rings here. This one I got um, from my mom for my eighth grade graduation. Oh my gosh. Went to MS, uh, PSMS 124 in Queens. And uh, this one I got from my aunt um, when I was also young. And this one, my best friend, Kim Wadi, oh from fifth grade, she, she gave this to me. Not in fifth grade, because my wrist would be really tiny. Yeah, but, but that's a beautiful bracelet. <laughs> I love that. You so, so you much. wear that every time you perform. And now it's probably one of those like good luck things. You can't yes, take them off. Yes, I always wear these ones. I think it's just like me like carrying them with me yeah you know, just having their presence with me and just the generations of of women who were a part of raising me yes and yeah. made you who you are today mm -hmm. i mean the songs that you're singing during this show are are like Katy Perry songs. They're like empowering, they're mm -hmm. strong. When you finish singing all these songs, don't mm -hmm. you feel that kind oh, of yeah. strength behind you? Oh yes, I do, I definitely do. And I'm, I'm still learning and I'm still growing every single day. I'm gaining more and more confidence. Juliet really inspires Lorna and Lorna inspires Juliet. Yeah, <laughs> what are you hearing at the stage door these days? Because this is a oh. whole new experience for you. This is your first time as a, a yeah. lead on Broadway mm -hmm. And you got the Tony nomination. So what is Thank that you. after each show the, for you? I love our fans so, so much. And they come so many times. I think Hannah is probably came about 44 times already, one of our oh fans. And she gives gosh. us written notes. And I also love looking out into the audience and, and seeing young girls who are inspired yeah. and who are, who are singing along and looking up at me with just bright eyes yes. and it feels wonderful to be an inspiration for someone. Yes, well you absolutely are <laughs> and I can't wait to see what happens at the Tonys. You can catch Anne Juliet at the Stephen Sondheim Theater. For tickets and more info head to AnnJulietBroadway.com. Thank you so much. Thank Lana. you. Thank you.